I think I'll be back a little bit here in my story called uh, All Disney Black Rock. Oh, that's the novel. The, all, the novel's All Disney Black Rock or Black Rock Redemption. But this story I'm reading is has got two names. It's either Alla in Wonderland or the 100th name of Alla. I'll continue here. Okay. Rockman looked a little disturbed and said, but it, it sounds so evil to do that to, to innocent, unsuspecting people who are basically following Koran 568 about standing firm upon the Torah and Injil Bible and obeying Koran 547 about using the Injil New Gospel, New Testament to judge therein of the clear signs, Koran. And whatever, and what, and, and, and what, would happen to my fellow Muslims if they obeyed Quran 1094 about coming to those who have been reading the before scriptures Bible? What if my fellow Muslims obey Quran 1094 and go to those who um, and go to those tricked people, the Christians, and the Christians are successful are successful in convincing them that Judas wasn't made to look like you, uh, but that the person on the cross really was you. Have you ever thought of that? That you, Isa, son of Mary, did go to the cross making sense of the Torah with all the mentioning of the sin offerings and blood atonement created, created by the sacrifice of innocent animals. You think that is fair to deceive the Muslims? You know? The Muslim Jesus uh, just smiled and said, uh, I've got a question. I, I, I've got a scripture for you. It goes as it, it goes. Uh, uh -huh. O you who believe, ask uh, not questions about things which, if made plain to you, may cause you trouble. But if ye, Rahman then jumped in and finished the ayat scripture with, but if you ask about things when the Quran is being revealed, they will be made plain to you. Some people before you did ask such questions and on account lost their faith. Oh, very good, my fellow slave. Very good, laughed the Koran, Jesus. Rahman looked scared and asked, Your dad, not dad, truly is the best of deceivers, isn't he? The Koran, Jesus, uh, uh, let out a, uh, uh, burst out in laughter and said, That, my fellow slave, is an understatement. But remember, the tricking of Jews and Christians into eternal burning in hell, fire, uh, tricking them with not uh, tricking them with my only appearing to go to the cross and making sense of the Torah's talk of innocent animals being used for sin offerings and blood atonement only ends with them. I mean, all that promise of having sex with children who are fresh and virginal, who are eternally chaste and beautiful forever if you obey Quran 9 111 about killing and being killed in my dad, not dad's cause. Well, that pretty much. That, that is pretty much the only thing you can believe from my dad 100% about. I mean, he, they, Allah, uh, certainly was being funny when describing the sun asking permission to rise again or the earth being uh, uh, spread out on a giant fish or in Quran 36, 40 through 43, the, the sun and moon traveling in boats similar to that of Noah. I mean, I mean come on, my dad is... My dad is a punk, a punking artist. Don't you know my dad, not dad, has a great sense of humor? What have you, uh, what, what you have to understand is, is that um, my dad, not dad, is only tricking the very stupid and imbeciles, the lunatics. For no one, even below average intelligence, will fall for my dad, not dad's humor and deception. No one of average intelligence, at least, is, is going to uh, fall for those stupid things he, he, they, my dad, Allah, had Muhammad saying in the Quran and the Hadith, laughed the Quran, Jesus. I mean, come on. Even if Satan did sleep in our noses at night, like my dad, not dad, uh, had Muhammad saying in Sahih Hadith, well, why wash your nose out even if Satan is? We're, we're actually to actually be sleeping in all our noses at night. Satan certainly doesn't interfere with your breathing and sense of smell, right? 
as the Quran Jesus laughed about uh, the punking power of his dad, not dad, Rahman was stunned at such a question. All he could say was, uh, uh. The Quran Jesus went on and said, and Muhammad says that Satan farts whenever he hears the call to prayer. Well, that would mean Satan is farting in your nose every hour on the hour since it's the call to prayer somewhere in the world. Even when you are sleeping, it would mean Satan is farting in your nose. I mean, think about it. My dad, not dad, is just being funny. He is truly the king of punking. He, they, Allah, has basically declared a war on the mentally challenged. That's all. No one in their right mind is going to fall for such stupidity and ending up washing their nose out three friggin' times every time they do ablution. Are you kidding me? So don't blame my dad, not, uh, not dad having, ret uh, for, so don't blame my dad for having retards believing such crazy shit by having Muhammad saying things like Satan sleeping in your nose at night. As the crying Jesus laughed, Rahman, ang Rahman felt anger building toward him, for he spent a lot of time washing his nose out three times to remove what he thought was a sleeping Satan, only pretending to be snot. I'm not your, I'm not your dad, Isa, son of Mary, screamed the little pudgy guy in anger at the Quran Jesus. The Quran Jesus, the Quran Jesus shouted back at Allah in a mocking uh, sort of way. Yeah, and, and a blamer is a Christian. Rahman looked down at the ground and said, so Jews and Christians well, they are going to be ransom out of hell. Uh, uh, they're going to be ransom out of hell uh, for really evil Muslims, the ones who have sins heavy as mountains. True? Right, they are, smiled the Quran, Jesus. Because, because as Quran 98 says, 98, 6 says, non-Muslims, which would be Jews and Christians, are the worst of creation. Rahman asked, was Muhammad telling the truth here, or is it like him saying Satan sleeps in our noses at night? The Quran Jesus said, This time Muhammad was telling the truth. Rahman then asked, then said, Is the Quran always true? You, uh, you seem to uh, mock uh, Quran 36, 40 through 43 about the sun and moon traveling in a boat similar to that of Noah. Are you saying the sun and moon don't travel in boats similar to that of Noah? It's metaphoric. You don't know what metaphor is, don't you? Asked the Quran Jesus in a condescending way, a manner. The Quran Jesus then said, It's like Muhammad saying in Al-Tabari Hadith that the sun and moon travel in a chariot and a solar eclipse occurring if the sun and moon fall out of, that, out of said chariot. Metaphoric. Rafa made a gulping sound and asked, by worst of creation, you mean really sinful, right? The Muslims who have sins heavy as mountains are really evil and they are placed on the Christians, right? Of course. What else could it mean? The, the Quran Jesus said after rolling his eyes like Rockman was stupid. Of course. What else could it mean? Rockman then asked, well, doesn't the Quran tell us uh, to believe what Muhammad says, which is why we are to believe in the Hadith and the sayings in the Hadith. Right, said the Quran Jesus. Rahman went on and said, if Jews and Christians are really sinful due to being the best of deceivers, uh, wrong. Only Allah is the best of deceivers, said the Quran Jesus with a, with a a uh, smile. Oh, it said the Quran Jesus when a smile. Oh, it said the Quran Jesus with a smile and, and closed eyes. Only oh, all is the best deceivers. Rothman continued with, "Well, if they really, if they are really evil, being that they are taking on the sins of really of really evil Muslims, since." They, uh, uh, since they have sins as heavy as mountains. Well, doesn't that contradict the clear signs, the Quran, when the Quran says, say, shall I seek uh, 
lord other than Allah, while he is the lord of all things. No person earns any sin except against himself only, and no bearer of burden shall bear the burden of another. Quran 6, 164. The eyes of the Quran, Jesus reopened, and he quit smiling. The little pudgy man who called himself Allah only looked nervous. <laughs> I think 